guys got the Austin Regional coming up. Four straight years, this team's been, this program's been in the NCAA tournament. Just talk about what it means to you guys, especially Jordan, you've been there for last year, making it to round 16 plus. This is your first year playing collegiate tennis. Just talk about getting to the NCAA tournament this year and what it means to you guys. I mean, it's what we work for, yeah. And we want to peak at the end of the season. That's, that was our goal at the start. And that's what we aim to do. So to, to make the tournament, for me, two years in a row is great. And hopefully we, we can do well. Uh, it's going to be my first time. I mean, uh, I'm really excited. We've been uh, practicing for it the entire year. Uh, we've been building a new team, and uh, I feel like we're all excited about it. Now this year's kind of different. Last year, in the last two years we posted here at Mississippi State. Now we're heading on the road, and it's kind of a, it's going to be a different kind of field than the teams had the past couple of years. Just how do you address going to a place like Austin? It's the number nine national seed, and kind of fighting that atmosphere. I mean, it's going to be tough. Uh, Playing away against anyone is tough. Uh, we we want to look for the first one first against Louisiana, and we just mm -hmm. want to make sure we prepare as well as we can for these four days and get some good practices in, prepare off the court as well as we can, and hopefully get some t get two wins. We'll be good. Right, we're preparing. I think we're preparing good, and uh, we have to just keep going. And uh, we're outsiders, so there we have a first match, and uh, if we do, if we make it, uh, it's going to be Texas. Uh, they're supposed to win, and uh, I think uh, I like I like it to be an outsider, you know. So I'm even more pumped. I know a big part of y'all's game, Pair preaches a lot is bringing energy, and you two guys on the court usually the loudest ones, very into it. I mean, just very vocal, very pumped all the time. Just talk about how important now that is this time around playing postseason tournament. I know that's very important to you guys on a game to game basis, but now with, with you know kind of getting on the national spotlight, national stage. How important now is it to be very vocal and just show the other team that you know, like, make your presence known from the start. I mean, it's huge. It's yeah. huge. Uh, I mean, every time we we've been loud, we've been playing good. You know, it's it, it just goes together, and uh, that's what we've been working on uh, every day at practice. And uh, yeah, we're we're maybe especially loud, but mm -hmm. I think all the teams know it. And uh, especially, I mean, especially playing away. I mean, we're not at home. We don't have a, we don't have anyone behind us. Right. It's just us, and we just have to make our presence known and go out and be as loud as we can. And regardless of the outcome of this, this tournament, you guys kind of like the foundation for this program going forward. You lose Malt and Zach, the seniors, but Jordan, you step up being junior flow. You had you step up this sophomore along with a couple other freshmen in the squad. Just talk about the foundation this team, this year's team is laid, and how you're going to build on it for the next coming years. I mean, we've looked to Malt and Zach to lead us this year and I think as the season's gone on me and Flo have kind of realised that next year it's our year to step up so we have to start showing what we can do and it's our team and we want to lead it how we want to lead it so. Alright, it's already, yeah, it's started as a new team this year, we've we've had five freshmen and uh, it's, yeah, it was all new, we had Zach and Malt to show us the right way, now it's our turn to step it up and show the new guys how it's done.